Hey guys, how's it going? Splash Cards here, back with a new video, and today we're opening up a 2022-23 Chronicles Blaster Box. I don't know a lot about this product, I haven't opened up any yet this year, so it'll be fun to see what we can get. We got 6 Blaster exclusive parallels per box, we got 42 cards per box, and these are just some of the things we can get rookie autographs, we can get 4 Blaster exclusive rookie and star cards, and yeah, 7 cards per pack, 6 packs. Um, let me see if the, here, yeah, here's the info. Let me get it open and I'll show you guys the, the info that we can hit. But I'm super excited to see what we can get. Obviously some big names here with Ivy, Smith, Matherin, Williams, Murray, and Paolo. Those are the guys we're looking for. And here's the info. So you can, let me see if I can, if you guys can read that, but you can get one of ones and you can get out of tens, you can get all the way numbered from 99 to one. So there is a good ceiling on this. If you guys don't know, Chronicles has purely stars and rookies. So the value of the base cards and base rookies is not a lot. In fact, it's even like really nothing to an extent, like a dollar for a Palo rookie. But it still is a pretty good set in the sense that there are some good autos in here and some other things that are pretty good. So. We'll be looking to get those, and let's see what we can get. So we got Kevon Harris, rated rookie. We got Jeremy Sohan on that. Is that like Valor or something? I don't remember what that set's called. That's a nice looking card. We got Chet on a absolute rookie. We got Shaden Sharp on a Chronicles base. And then we got LeBron on a pink. You guys can tell that here, that foil is kind of tough to see. We got Tari Eason on a backwards card. Is this, okay, just a regular XR Tari Eason. And then a Keegan Murray. This is one of the silver, not silver, but the chrome card score. It's not a bad card there. So yeah, if you guys can't tell, it's a lot of rookies, a lot of stars. Um, so we got, yeah, here, Jaden Ivey on Luminance. It's a nice looking card. We got Matherin, we got Sharp on the Pinnacle. Patrick Baldwin on a pink pinnacle. Giannis base. And this one is Jaden Ivey. This one's gonna trip me up because I can't tell if these are autos or just regular cards that are flipped around, but this one is a marquee. And then AJ Griffin just flipped backwards essentials card. So yeah, so <laughs> some of these are a little, the pack structure is a little bit off, but let's see we can get in this pack we got aj griffin on the absolute we got osheg baji on the luminance Giannis on the valor i, I want to say it's valor let me double check and see if it says it i don't see it anywhere um but i'm gonna say it's valor if it's not then my condolences but i'll put that in the little text below here <laughs> um we got ujman jang kd a Jeremy Sohan, this one is just the marquee card. And then Jokic on a pink XR. I know Chronicles Hobby is pretty solid um, in terms of like hitting big rookies, big rookie autos, but I mean, it's crazy because here's Roddy. Um, the Paolo Benko autos are selling for like 150, 100 sometimes to up to 200 like the 100 to 200 range and yet the box is selling for 250 so if you hit an auto of the best player possible it still doesn't even break you even with those boxes so nice walker kessler here but yeah if you guys have noticed i haven't been opening up a lot of boxes recently it is because of that that they're just so expensive and you're not getting your quality back there's a shade and sharp and aj griffin on the hoops premium but yeah so it's kind of weird um so I think Panini prices will slowly start to go down, but we'll see how long that takes. Uh, and obviously with Victor Wembanyama, they're probably not gonna go down much, but Ty Ty Washington, got Jaden Ivey, David Roddy, James Harden, Jaden Ivey on the pink Chronicles here. We got Jason Tatum and John Morant. Nice cards there. We got our last pack of the box. So let's see if we can hit a numbered card, maybe an auto. If not, we did get some good rookies, some nice pink parallels. But we got Johnny Davis, Chet, Jalen Duran, 
Jaden Ivey. We've got Jason Tatum. We've got Sohan on the XR. And then Bochamp on a nice pink. There we go. So I'm going to do a quick recap here. Um, I'm not sure exactly how I was organizing these. I was just kind of doing it by big name rookies and such. So let's... Oh gosh, that card is slipping out. Okay. Let's go through this real quick. We got Durin, Ivy, Soham, Chet, Ivy Pink. Put that one there for now. Um, Griffin, Sharp, Kessler Pink, Jokic Pink. Uh, Do we get any other... Keegan Murray score is not bad. And then, yeah, so in terms of the big cards here, I'm going to say this Keegan Murray scorecard, Walker Kessler, Pink Luminance, Jaden Ivey, Pink Chronicles, and then this Marjan Bochamp, Pink from Marquee. So not a bad box. The thing with Chronicles is that since you're getting a lot of these rookies and stuff, they're each worth like a dollar. So if you sell it, you'd probably make your money back. But um, you really are looking for those big hits from this. And I don't think we got a big, big one, but some of these cards here aren't too bad. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below your favorite card. Mine out of this bunch, I think is going to be the Walker Kessler. I really do like the Luminance set, and I think that the pink adds a nice touch. So I'm going to go with this one. Uh, the Marquee Marjan Bochamp is also pretty nice, but I'm going to go with the Walker Kessler. Let me know down below what you guys think. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you guys are having a great day, and I'll catch you later. Peace.